Hey, this is Big Mark Clark from Laser 101.7. Today we're going to be cooking Achiote tacos on a Weber Genesis grill from Arrow Ace Hardware. Now, you're asking yourself, what is Achiote tacos? Well, about a year ago, our entire family went down to Isla Mujeres in Mexico. We found a nice little mom-and-pop restaurant there, and they had Achiote tacos. This is what Achiote is. It's a paste. Okay, and so you take the paste, all the ingredients, blend it, put it on a nice flank steak. We have a two pound flank steak right here. This is a beautiful cut of meat. I've kind of trimmed off some of the fat. We're going to marinate the achiote sauce on the flank steak overnight, cook it on the Weber grill tomorrow. Now, if you haven't been to Arrow Ace Hardware and you want to upgrade your grill, you need a new grill, you have to stop by. They have the Fire It Up Grill Station. They've got a great selection of grills, smokers, ceramics, pellet, charcoal, you name it, they got it. And they're the most knowledgeable staff about grilling in the area. So if you have questions, if uh, you're not sure about something, stop by any Arrow Ace Hardware and talk to the staff. They're absolutely wonderful. Uh, I've made the mistake before, too. I bought a grill because, you know, it was inexpensive. Thinking, hey, this is great. I get an inexpensive grill. I get to grill out all the time. And then, of course, in three or four years, the burners go out, the grates go out. It winds up being a terrible, terrible experience. Well, with a Weber grill, you don't have to worry about that. They have the top-notch warranty, the best warranty in the business. And probably one of the greatest things about Arrow Ace Hardware is they have free assembly, and they've got free delivery within a 10-mile radius of the store. Plus, if you buy a Weber grill, you get 20% off all the accessories for an entire year. You know that Weber grills are basically the same price everywhere. That nobody else has you know, lower prices than the other. But that's where you get the real big gain is the 20% off on the accessories. All right, let's make achiote tacos, shall we? Here's what we got. We got two ounces of the achiote paste. We're going to put that in our blender. Then we got uh, three freshly squeezed limes. That's a really big deal, you guys. Do the fresh stuff. So we put freshly squeezed limes in there. We've got two tablespoons of red vinegar. We've got two tablespoons of grapeseed oil. Now, if you can't find grapeseed oil, don't worry about it. You can use regular oil, cooking oil. Just need some sort of oil. This recipe calls for grapeseed oil, so we're going to put that on there. Oh, and by the way, don't worry about writing all these ingredients down. I'll put the recipe at the end of the video for you, okay? And then right here, we've got... Two tablespoons of kosher salt. That's a big deal. Make sure it's kosher salt. We've got a teaspoon of oregano. We have a half a teaspoon of cumin. We've got two garlic cloves, diced and minced. We have about a tablespoon of adobe sauce. And you've got one tablespoon of black pepper. That all goes in as well. Okay, now you want to hit it with the blender for a few minutes. Make sure everything is... Uh, Nice and combined. Okay, now that we've made a nice marinade, we're going to pour it into a large Ziploc bag. And then we're going to put our flank steak inside the Ziploc bag. Most people will use like a, a Tupperware or something like that. I like using the, uh, the Ziploc bag because it, it helps me... I get, I'm a nut about it, so I'll walk around for two, three hours, come to the kitchen, go to the fridge, and shake it up, just to make sure everything gets evenly coated for nice, consistent flavor on these steaks. So that's what it's going to look like when it goes into the fridge. You can do it for four or five hours, you can do it uh, overnight, you can do it for 12 hours, it's up to you. Of course, the longer you marinate it, the better the flavor is. So this is going to go in the fridge right now. And then when we come back, we're going to head out to the Weber Grill in my garage, and we're going to start cooking with Aero Ace Hardware. Okay, here we are with our Achiote marinated flank steak. It's gone for 24 hours now. We're going to throw it on the Weber Grill. Here's what I like to do on the Weber Grill. Number one, I like to be at 350. Really easy to control the heat on the Weber Grill. Number two, indirect flame. So uh, just let it kind of sit there for about 5 minutes, 10 minutes, and then flip it. Once it gets that rubbery consistency when you flip it, you know you're getting close to being done. Then I put it on the flame, give it a nice char. So we're going to throw this on the grill right now. Look at that. We're going to 
check that in about 10 minutes. Get that heat up and get back up to 350. Another thing I love about the Weber grills are the cast iron container it has. It virtually has no holes in it. It keeps air out. Where I live, it's a very windy place. You notice I'm grilling in my garage. I do that all year long because of the wind. I can't take it out on the deck. It blows out the flame. Well, even with a Weber, you wouldn't have to worry about that. You could go out on the deck. You could go anywhere you wanted to go. I still like being in my garage because that means I can do it 365 days a year. So we're going to let this go for about 10 minutes. We'll check back in on it in a little bit. Okay, I think we're about ready. I've already turned it. I've got it on high heat right now on the flame to get a little char on the outside. Let's take a look and see if it's ready. Oh, it's ready. Take a look at this. Look at how nice that looks. It's the Achiote flank steak cooked on the Weber grill from Arrow Ace Hardware and Paint. Doesn't get much better than that. If you need more information about a grill, smoker, pellet grill, doesn't matter. They can take care of you. Arrowace.net. Go to the website right now. Thank you guys for watching.